Friends, Romans, countrymen, togas, and Greek foods. What does all this mean? It means Roman Festival Day at Duncanville High School. For five years at Duncanville High School, sophomore English teachers have taught William Shakespeare's The Tragedy of Julius Caesar. During the four six weeks, students turn in projects and have a big Roman festival to increase the unit's enjoyment. The Smith, Davis, Robertson, and Ackerman originated the festival and held the activities in their own classrooms. This year, all sophomore English teachers decided to have an joint Roman festival in Building 9 Cafeteria. Students brought a variety of foods like bread, pizza, grapes, spaghetti, cheese, and deviled eggs, which were similar to the foods the Romans used to eat years ago. The students are required to make or buy these foods themselves. Students and teachers both dress up in a variety of stylish togas. We gathered some comments of students and teachers. Their efforts were so successful and so much fun that they decided to make the Roman Festival an annual event. Well, it started five years ago when I came and, and Ms. Smith, Ms. Julie at the time was new, and Ms. Davis and Ms. Robertson and I decided we need to do something fun and since we all like to eat, we thought this would be a real good idea. So every year it's grown and all the sophomore English teachers do it. And anyone new to our sophomore level doesn't have a choice, they have to do it too. I think my favorite food is um like this pizza type stuff except it was like mixed with olives and cottage cheese and they put it on top of the pizza and then they put on sliced menu mushrooms and then sliced pepperoni and they they didn't cook it and it, it tasted like really different well i liked some of them but most of them were too different and i didn't want to try them <laughs> so lend me your ears roman festival day at duncanville high school was a big hit with students and faculty alike